uh, this is the this is the already existing this is the circuit for when the UTP and LTP have the same magnitude now we are going to sh show that when the UTP and LTP have different magnitude and 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 this is the this is the circuit diagram this is the Smith trigger using op amp when the given UTP and LTP are not of equal magnitude and this is the circuit diagram is shown here and you can see we have chosen UTP as equal to 4 volt and LTP is equal to 2 volt and we know that V set equal to approximately 10 volt and according to the design we know that R1 is equal to 1 kilo ohm and R2 equal to 9 kilo ohm and V reference should be given as 3.3. Therefore, we just we make the changes here. What are the changes here? We have to we have to bring one. We have to be reference. Therefore, we 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 are uh, break, we'll break, we'll change the circuit. We are, will not drawing the same circuit again. And 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 but you have to draw the same circuit again. Therefore, in the exams, therefore you uh, I'm just make a change of it. Therefore, ground I'm eliminating. And in, instead of and and the resistance value get changed here. Before it was. Uh, 2k now it, it is r1 is 1k therefore i just double click here and i make it to make it to 1k make it to 1k and then and this r2 is equal to uh, according to the design it is 9k therefore i make it to 9k here and remaining remaining connections everything remain the same i have to bring a uh, dc voltage therefore i just i am going i am clicking here on the parts Therefore, now VDC, uh, yes, already is uh, VDC, I am just uh, clicking on that. After that, uh, I am clicking it here and then I do not require anything more. I just uh, I just right click and end mode and then I give a value here as 3.3. .3. Here I am giving 3.3 volt, 3.3, 3.3 volt, okay after that you can see it is appear 3.3 now i'll connect to this this one i'll drag i you just select it and and keep the mouse down and drag it and bring it here bring it here and then you bring a uh, ground here you click on the ground and you can you can click on the zero and then you place it okay and then you connect it here connect it here and that is you do not require anything more you right click and end mode and that is the complete circuit and it is a complete circuit for UTP and LTP of unequal magnitude when when the UTP and LTP have of different magnitudes now already you have I told you that UTP we have chosen as 4 and LTP we have chosen as 2 volt and for that the designing is uh, R1 is 1K, R2 is a 9K, and V reference is 3.3 volt. Now we create uh, here. You can you can see uh, there. You can see that uh, there is a star. We create a. Uh, we can star. We, I clicked on the star. I click ST. Anything you can give is ST T T. I can give. I can give any name. Uh, you can I can create. I create here here that you can go to the down you can go to, after going to the down uh, you can this uh, simulation setting is is coming and here again it, it is uh, uh, 1000 nanosecond i we, because our uh, we want to uh, our our frequency is 50 hertz therefore our time period is uh, 20 millisecond and will take uh, 100 millisecond it will display five complete cycle it will display after that you will apply apply it then then you can bring the oscilloscope this this will act uh, you look at the cursor this will act as an oscilloscope one is a six pin number six other is pin number two the pin number six is for output waveforms and pin number two is for input waveform now you can see triangular you run it you run it and in the and in the bottom you can see some uh, is is graph already came we enlarge it and you see what type of graph we can we is visible you can see that here the graph is graph is visible here and you can you can see now uh, this is a, a zero zero volt and this is a 10 volt and one division is one division is two volt therefore you can see whenever whenever 
output whenever I, uh, uh, input is crossing 4 whenever input is crossing 4 you can see the output changes state from high to low it changes the state from high to low therefore that 4 is the upper trip point and we, we call it as a UTP and as the input wave goes to the peak of 10 volt then it come down to 2 you can see at the 2 it happens it crosses the output wave from the at the 2 volt when it crosses 2 volt and come down to less than 2 volt then again the output waveform changes from low to high and this point is known as this two, two point is known as which is 2 volt here is known as the lower trip point therefore in our case the upper trip point is you can see very clearly upper uh, is a two divisions where the uh, green and red is crossing and therefore upper trip point is uh, in, in this case is a 4 volt and in the lower trip point is where it is again it is crossing and uh, that red and green waveform are crossing at 2 volt and lower trip point is 2 volt and therefore we designed for that that only UTP of uh, 4 volt and LTP of 2 volt and we are getting the same thing in the in, in the waveforms also.